Tony Vassell's record with dealings is second to none. Aquanita Racing. Joined by Tony Vassell at Caulfield and you've got uh, Green Birdie nominated for the Yellow Glen Stakes over 1,200 this weekend. Yeah, uh, he's been nommed for the 1,200 on Saturday, uh, which is a $300,000 sprint race over 12. Uh, also threw him in the 1,400. Um, but I am also going to nominate him for Tuesday. Uh, There's a, a $150,000 listed race over the same journey down the straight thinking that maybe Saturday and uh, it was going to be strong and uh, certainly the following weekend with the Patton Act. So Tuesday might be the right way to go. He's uh, He's been sort of a, around the, the fringe of, uh, of uh, success without winning. A um, little bit disappointing last start, but uh, all his other runs have been quite sound. He hasn't been very far away, just luck hasn't gone his way. But, uh, you know, he'd only have to pull out one of his better runs and he'd, he'd be sort of pretty competitive. If he's competitive on Tuesday, so he'll go straight down to the pat back? Oh, I wouldn't back him up on the, no, I wouldn't back him up that quick, no. And you've got Carrera's son that goes around this Wednesday over the 2200? Yeah, Carrera's son's coming off a, uh, a very good win last start at Cranbourne uh, on a Sunday, two Sundays ago. Um, got back to last and just uh, picked them off one by one and got all the runs and hit the line very strongly. That was over 2,040. Uh, he steps up to uh, the 2200 Bendigo and Bendigo Cup day. So, unfortunately, Dwayne Dunn, who rode him very well last start, is suspended. So, um, we've got Damien Oliver on to, to replace him, but I don't think we've lost anything there. Tony Vassell's record with dealings is second to none. Aquanita Racing.